The lavish gifts of King Frederick, showering his heirs in opulence. Throughout history, kings and queens have been known for their extravagant lifestyles. But few monarchs have earned the reputation for excessive gift-giving quite like King Frederick. Today, we delve into the treasure trove of lavish presents he bestowed upon his children and grandchildren, leaving a legacy of opulence and extravagance. King Frederick, renowned for his love of the finer things, ruled with a lavish hand. This extended not only to his own court but also to his family, showering them with gifts of unimaginable value. First, let's turn our attention to his eldest son, Crown Prince Friedrich Wilhelm. Upon his marriage, the king gifted him a magnificent palace, Schloss Charlottenburg, adorned with gold leaf, intricate tapestries, and priceless artwork. The Crown Prince's wife, Princess Sophie Dorothea, received a staggering collection of jewels, including a necklace featuring a diamond the size of a walnut. King Frederick's daughter, Princess Wilhelmine, known for her rebellious spirit, received a different kind of extravagant gift. Passionate about the arts and sciences, she was presented with a library filled with over 5,000 rare books and a personal scientific laboratory equipped with the latest instruments. Even his younger son, Prince August Wilhelm, wasn't left out. He received a life-sized, solid silver model of a ship he commanded in the Navy, a testament to his naval ambitions. It's important to consider the historical context surrounding these gifts. King Frederick ruled during a time of intense competition and political maneuvering among European powers. His extravagant displays of wealth, including gift-giving, could be seen as a way to solidify alliances, impress potential suitors for his children, and project an image of power and prosperity. The impact of these gifts was undeniable. They not only secured the comfort and luxury of his family, but also served as powerful symbols of his wealth and influence. However, some historians argue that this excessive spending contributed to the kingdom's financial strain. From dazzling palaces to priceless jewels and scientific marvels, King Frederick's gifts were a testament to his extravagant nature. They remain a reminder of a bygone era where monarchs wielded their wealth to shape not just their own lives but also the political landscape around them. But what do you think? Was King Frederick's generosity a mark of affection or a display of power? Share your thoughts in the comments below and let's discuss. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating stories from history. And if you enjoyed this video, let us know what other historical figures or topics you'd like to see explored in the future.